Hey nerds, it's Wildfire1. A lot of you had come to me in the past about doing a review on the Dan Aykroyd's Crystal Head Vodka. Well, uh, at first I was kind of on the fence about doing it, so I did a poll on Facebook asking you guys what you think, and you guys, you guys have spoken. You wanted me to do it. So I got my buddies uh, Hashtag and uh, P-Rock together, and we did the review. Of, uh, that was over the last weekend, of course. Now, uh, little Scully here is empty. And, uh, yeah. But you know what it is? A badass glass skull. With that, everyone, enjoy the video. It's the purest alcohol available. It's not double distilled. It's not triple distilled. It's quadruple distilled. It's quadruple distilled. Quadruple distilled. And filtered through charcoal, and then filtered again through Herkimer diamonds. <laughs> Herkimer? Herkimer! 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 Oh, I him well. Herkimer! 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 Before we start, I'm here with P Rock, Herkimer, Herkimer, and hashtag, hashtag. Awesome. Anyway, you guys asked for it, so we're doing a review on the Crystal Head Vodka, right? That is right. So hold that up. And Who makes this vodka? Well, Dan Aykroyd. Dan freaking Aykroyd. Dan freaking Aykroyd. A freaking ghost freaking buster. No. A blues brand. A blues brother. So, so we're gonna try this. We're gonna try it a few different ways. We're gonna give you our review on this. Like, if it tastes good, if it's as good as everyone says. And we had to it's get heavy. Yeah, it's really it's heavy. Heavy. Well, it's, it's made out of crystals. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's the same liter as like a gigantic thing of Kettle yeah. One or a gigantic thing of Sky. Or well, why are you bringing up other vodkas? Are you cheating on the Crystal Head? I haven't tried the Crystal Head yet. It's not cheating. Oh um, yeah, we're actually. This is like a relationship them. where your your wife or girlfriend <laughs> gives you shit for something you did ten years ago. It's your. So the bottle is actually pretty awesome. It's got like he was like uh, P Rock was saying earlier. It's got all the dents in the like the like what you'd expect in a skull. So we're gonna we're gonna come at you with a few uh, a little bit of information because we're really here to open this thing up. We're really here to drink it and give you guys a review on it. I mean, we're drinking it. So. Let's get right, right in. Right. So give us give us the information on the box. <laughs> Chris Lad Vodka uses the highest quality grain and pristine water from Newfoundland, Canada, and craft uh, to craft an additive free, gluten free vodka. I already don't want this vodka. Thank you. You said it's crap. Absolutely nothing is added to enhance or mask the taste. Okay, I want crap. Crystal Head is quadruple distilled and filtered seven times. What? Seven times. <laughs> three. Possessed. Hold on. Three. I think you're possessed by Dan Eckroyd right now. <laughs> Three of the filtration filtrations pass through layers of Herkimer, Herkimer, Herkimer diamonds as a final distinctive touch. <laughs> the integrity of the skull-shaped bottle was proudly designed with a pure spirit in mind. Together, Dan Aykroyd and John Alexander sought to craft a vessel worthy of multi-award-winning ultra-premium vodkas. <laughs> a unique achievement of creativity, craftsmanship, purity, and quality. Uh, How much do you qualify for? Give me your money. How much? Eighty dollars. Apparently. <laughs> By the way, this was eighty dollars. So yeah. It's anywhere. Yes, yeah, anywhere between sixty, 60 and some and odd and eighty dollars. This was uh, the last bottle. <laughs> With that said, we're gonna go ahead and open this puppy, and we're gonna pour it, and we're gonna do our drinks, and then we're gonna start. We're gonna start by okay. drinking it normally. With like sips, and then we're gonna go from that to. Well, we'll compare it to straight like kettle yeah. one. Something that's yeah. a. It's not. I mean, it was. It's your. Medium. Regular yeah, top it's shelf. Like it's not like a, a thousand dollar. It's like it's like Applebee's even. top shelf versus. It's like a bar like, top shelf. Yeah. Uh, this is like going to Ruth's Chris, and Kettle One's like going to Applebee's. Well, technically, this is supposed to be up there better than Kettle One. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a one to ten uh, style rating. So if this is like anything past the five, it's okay. It's good here for I I well, I'll I'll make a disclosure. I like Kettle One. I will only drink Kettle One, Belvedere, or Grey Goose. You got that Russian Standard. The Russian Standard was pretty good, actually. Yeah, That's a very good yeah. comparison, actually. Really good stuff. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll get the Russian Standard. What, too, what I'm but... asking you to do is compare it to what you know. Okay. If this thing's like the sky or below, never again. Yeah. Like it'll be a fucking waste. Yeah, this of... is the one and done. If yeah. it's sky or below. I'm not saying sky's bad, but sky's 19 bucks. Yeah. For... Oh, so, dude, oh, you did that. Do it again. Oh. Do that again. Pull that out one oh, more it time. It won't work. It won't work. It was. Aww. You know, it's like the first time you, can only, do, you can only be popped once. Did you hear that? Wait, wait, wait. Shh, shh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Go and clap for Dan Aykroyd. Come on, let's put that one. Oh, okay. Good job. Okay, pour us a drink. That's just 
beautiful. And do I pay? Is it face forward or face back? I don't give a fuck. Okay, so okay, it's not very conveniently. What you got to do is pour it over and then twist. Okay, just half a shot, right? We're doing a taste <laughs> test over there. I can tell you the cork smells like Let's a decent You want to smell, guys? And well, on me. That's uh, smells oh. like vodka. Yeah, it smells like vodka. It doesn't it does? It, but but some vodka smells like it has a kick, right? Like Oof. this doesn't really smell that Christ strong. Almighty. We gotta give the wife a smell. We're giving. We're giving yeah. Hashtag wife a smell. It doesn't smell bad, right? No, it doesn't it's not. Like, all right, all right gentlemen. Okay, saloon. Oh, I'm gonna taste so, it. Then I'm gonna shoot it. Cause I want to taste wait, it. Wait, swirl wait, it. Wait, wait, no, no, no. This is how we're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you, dude? That was. <laughs> it was bad. I'm, I'm impressed. Okay, hold on. It's the diamonds. Oh god. Mm. It's a little strong, which it, it's vodka, but. <sighs> It's not think? bad. He did he? I mean, he rock. It's 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 as uh, it it's as different. strong and harsh as like a mild white lightning, yeah. like like moonshine even, without the hard like car, uh, like a like a moonshine has like a caramel. I don't, how do I explain that? Like a almost like a diesel taste, right? Rick? Yeah. Gasoline taste. You're, you're this has that bite like a moonshine or a, or a really good strong vodka without the rub, super big rubbing alcohol kickback. Yeah, back. yeah. That's for, it's actually pretty good. It's not bad. You know I mean, but it, 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 like, it's but it's, 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 it's harsh and it's a bite, yeah. it, like a sharp stab, but yeah. not a. But it's not. not a, you it's know, not, it's not like a sharp stab followed by electricity. Here. Salud, ass salad. Let's do this salad. Trying to figure it out. You know what's kind of cool though? Lost. Like my tongue is a little like nummy. Yeah. Right like a moonshine. Yeah, it's like yeah. a moonshine. It's yeah. the Herkimer. It's the Herkimer. Her it's the Herkimer. You know what? It definitely tastes like I'm drinking diamonds right now. <laughs> no, that that tastes like seriously. Um, you know, five thousand year old Herkimer diamonds to me. Five thousand. If they were three thousand years old, they wouldn't be near as enjoyable. Well, oh no. 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 The, the wood sense. notes wouldn't be there. Now, no. now here's what I'm trying to understand or, or trying to figure out whether or not I was lying. Okay. Was I just sold a pile of eighty dollar bullshit saying that it was like non? It says not enhanced. Non. You know. Yeah. Okay. We're doing a second tasting. Let's take this, okay. this shot. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. Actually, that one went down smoother, in my opinion. I I, I could taste the crystal. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't. I can't. I, you know. What, it, you know what? It is for. Okay, because I'm not like a vodka kind of guy. I'm a, I, I, I'm I love good. like a, a single malt scotch or something like little, that. Yeah. Here, don't, don't. Ooh. This, this smells. Um, so here's kettle one. Yeah, this is kettle one. So this is the kettle one. I have to tell you, and I don't know if it's because we just drank another vodka, but this actually smells like rubbing alcohol to me. Kettle one doesn't. It never. Oh, yeah, comparison? Oh, yeah. fuck yeah, that is bad. That's why I give a little bit more. But, anyways. Saloon. Saloon. Good work. Oh. Oh, compared? Oh. oh. That is way better. Holy shit. Oh. Dan Ackroyd was right. <laughs> Wait, that's impossible. <laughs> Dude, that is way yeah, You know what? This has been sitting in my cupboard for a while. Let me get the other one. Unless it's I have to tell you, because this now tastes like a cheap ass go, fucking like, go grab go the other one. Vodka. Vodka. Yeah. Go grab the other one. It does taste like pop up. Go grab the other one and we'll try a little taste of it. Kill these and I can throw them in the fireplace or something. Just, yeah. Compared to that, that one we just took, that was like a 10. Tastes like burning. Tastes. I did not like. It. Like kettle. <laughs> oh. Tastes like ass. And I can't believe I'm saying that about kettle one. Yeah, dude. I don't think it's gonna matter. It's not. That it's is not. not I'm not. I'm not doing it. It's not. I'll. I'll take a small shot with you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Little step. I'm putting a little taste. Little taste. Yeah. That's little all. I literally a little splash. Okay. Cheers. All right, let's do it. Cheers, guys. Solid bar. <laughs> Still too. compared. <laughs> Compared, that's a oh 10. Oh my god. The crystal head is a 10 compared to that. I would say, okay, okay, okay well, honestly I shelf speaking, this. I would say this is normally top shelf shit. Okay, it's, like, it's, shit. Okay, it's a know, bitch to hold. I don't know how many bartenders would probably drop this fucker. Yeah, I would break they, it. They'd probably use the smaller bottle. They'd probably put in like a decanter it's, or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah it's it's very, that's, that's very time consuming and bullshit. <laughs> that's correct. Right. Yeah, night and day. Night Holy day. shit! Yeah. Wow! Night and day. That is that good. That is a big difference. That is good. I was about to really actually hate after, on it. After trying the other stuff, 
This stuff tastes so much smoother. Oh my god. It's smooth. Yeah. Good. Two thumbs up for me. It's, yeah, two thumbs up for sure. Pulling so, it, pouring it sucks. So, okay. For sure, no okay. good question. I'm going to give it, I'm going to stick with my seven, maybe eight. I, I'm staying at six and a half. Six and a half? Well, you just said it was good. You said it was ten. Well, it's good. Well, yeah, I'm saying in comparison to other vodkas, it's a ten, but it's still, it's, well, it's you not know. the best thing in the world to drink. I'm a solid eight for me. It's almost like a hurricane. Yeah. It's like a sunrise or whatever. Yeah. So it's not bad. It's it's actually really good. It it makes it. It ain't good. bad. The vodka. No, it's not. It's it's. Uh, can't hardly taste. Well, when Dan Aykroyd was talking about you know his commercial thing, if you guys go and watch that, he talks about even rags. He doesn't really rag. He just kind of backhands the other vodkas in the industry and saying, well, most people prefer to have no taste. We prefer not to, you know, we're interfere. Taste, no, yeah. well, yeah, and not interfere with the natural vodka taste and making it pure. But in doing that, it's actually a lot smoother. And yes, flavorful, which I at first, before I compared it to the Kettle One, I was confusing with a cheap reaction from the vodka being cheap. Yeah, yeah. But after tasting the Kettle One, I was completely wrong because all it did was bring out the impurities so it was of good. the Kettle One. It was good that we actually we actually yeah. compared. Like, it, it, and I think a special kid, right. because we're, we're into it, my brother's into it, my yeah. dad's into it, I think that if we were to get together, we would have a bottle there. Yes. Oh, yeah. And after we drank it, we'd have cheap shit to oh, kill the rest oh, yeah. of the night. Oh, yeah. But we would, this would be fun. Like when we go, when we go next month, we're probably going to have a bottle of this. This is our final oh, thoughts oh, on the, on this drink. Like we're, we tried it with three different, well, two different well, mixtures. Well, three straight. Three straight. Yeah. Then mango. So what would you give it? Like, like. And I'd it, say it's a, it's a, it's a seven. Like a seven. Well, what would be a 10 then? Yeah. Yeah, ben, benchmark a 10 for yeah, oh, what would a 10, what would a 10 uh, taste like? Then finished single malt scotch. What would be a 9? An 8 or Jameson. a 9? Jameson. Okay. Jameson so, vodka? Whiskey. Whiskey. No, but for a vodka. Oh, for a vodka. Oh, vodka. vodka. I it's haven't a vodka. tasted a 10 that was a vodka. But is this the closest 10 that you get? It's the closest to a 10 in vodka that I've had. Is it worth 80 bucks to you? Oh, yeah. No. No. Is it worth no. $60? If you were a vodka fan, would it be worth 80 it's <laughs> true. <laughs> and they kept on one thing to fuck me up. I gotta admit, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cry a little. I, I, that... What would you get? Like, let's start with that. So, so it's a nine. nine. It's a nine. It, and, and it's compared to the compared to what you had drank earlier, the other the other uh, vodka. What would you say the difference is? Like, to be fair, what's a ten? seven? Yeah. The kettle one's a seven. Okay. To be fair, what's, what's a, a ten, ten for you? I, I, there was a vodka I had tasted in Las Vegas at that Russian vodka bar. Okay. And it was in a martini, and all I did was chill it, but they didn't chill it over ice to water it down, they chilled it over stones. Okay. Oh. So, and they had shaken it in these, I just asked when they froze the stones, they said they're beyond frozen, right, or whatever the fuck that meant, I don't know, I was... Maybe they were... Uh, did they say a Russian accent? Oh, yeah. They were... I was thinking, he's like, this vodka is fucking rich. You like it, you not taste, it's fucking good. You tell me, take it off the bill. And he's fucking doing the fucking thing. <laughs> so, a seven? You gave it a seven? Nine. I would give it probably a nine as well. At first, I would say it's six or seven. I was about a six or a seven. Well, first. when you first try it, 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 it without without um, trying the other stuff, it, it just hits you. Like you know, you're like, oh man, this is kind of. And then you try but the other it, stuff. But then you try it with next to the other shit. Yeah. Like, oh my oh. god. The other oh, shit. I've had to go get a second garbage. bottle of the same shit, and one like, went bad. Okay. Yeah. I thought my first bottle went bad. So in my opinion, altogether, this is actually pretty good. It goes down smooth. It's a different kind of buzz. Like when you get drunk, when you get drunk off of it, it's like you walk into being drunk rather than being hit by a truck. It's a very clean, in. smooth buzz. Yeah, it's a very it, clean, it, smooth buzz. Like I it's mean, a welcoming buzz. It's not yeah. a Mack truck. When you're drinking, you know, okay, now I'm now I'm starting to feel the buzz. There's always that moment of like, whoa, oh, you realize okay. it. Okay. With this, I felt it evenly the yes. entire time with yes. each and sip. It, it kind of snuck up on you, but not really. Would you? Would you recommend this to people? Like, would you say, hey, go go buy this? I want, I'm not for $80. Only on a uh, special occasion. I want for a special occasion. Special, special occasion, like I agree. Yeah, only on like a special occasion. Like family, friends kind of thing. Um, you have to try it. Yeah, you, you just try it once. I think the buzz is super clean. It's not something you get every day, like we said. It's not something you get, like, all the time. But it's definitely something you can you can try out with your friends for special occasions and have fun, right? Yeah. Like we did today. Simone Holmes. I so, agree, sir. With that, guys, we're going to uh, end this and say... Salute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let me hold your hair back. <laughs>